What is going on, guys? I know it. I'm a nerd. Just let me do my thing. Yeah. Anyway, I'm sure you can tell I am not in the same place that my previous videos were, and that is because we had to change hotels. Um, and it's not that the other one was bad or anything, just we couldn't get a stay long enough for the course that I'm in, so... And there's a potential that I might have to change hotels one more time before I leave, so just get used to this. Also, how do you guys like my janky little camera setup I got going on down here? Yeah, that is some real uh, redneck engineering down here, I guess you could call it. I don't know. It's the best thing I could think of, and it works actually pretty well. I mean, if you look on the screen right here, it works pretty well. So, we are going to go with that. Um, as you can see, we are getting kind of low on sleeves, so I thought I'm going to remedy this problem in the most Pokemon card opening way that I know possible, and that is this. These two packs, 40 sleeves, ridiculousness that's probably not even worth it um, from... Target, but if you guys didn't know right now, well The time I'm recording this video Target has this really good deal going on actually where you know Spend a hundred dollars you get twenty five dollars off which I did I spent a hundred dollars. Well, I got a hundred dollars worth of cards for 75 Why I promise you are you kidding me like I've turned this thing off already and it still keeps coming back on and going for like four seconds, not even five, just four seconds and then going all the way. I don't know why it's doing that. Anyway, tangent over. I went to Target and I got some cards. Um, so you will see part of my stash that I just bought from there today. Uh, you won't be seeing all of it, obviously. That's a lot of cards to go through. But we did get this. Of course, the Dragon Majesties and the Fates Collide. I don't really care about the Fates Collide, but the Dragon Majesties, about a $5 pack. If you consider this a normal $3 pack, that's $8 right there. This is a $9.99 pack, so two bucks for 40 sleeves. Probably not the best deal in the world. Probably could have gotten something a little bit better, but uh, I really just wanted the Dragon Majesties. It was kind of my excuse to get it. And yeah, so we're gonna, you know what? I'm not going to rip into it yet because I didn't show you the other stuff. <laughs> what am I doing? Anyway, we got these. This nice bad boy right here. Two Forbidden Light um, booster packs in one Burning Shadows with a Garbodor Hollow. Don't really care about the Hollow, actually. Um, or the coin it has a Xerneas on it. Xerneas? Yeah, Xerneas on it. I think that's it. Could be volatile. I don't really know. Um, but they actually had like 10 of these boosters, uh, or blisters, I mean. So I may have bought a couple, mm, maybe. But that's not all. The first thing I saw when I went to Target, actually, and what kind of started this trend of maybe I should do the, the $25 off $100 deal, was this. I finally found one. So for those of you who may not know already, um, I'm a pretty big Marshadow fan. He's honestly, out of like the last four generations at least, he is by far my favorite. Um, love Marshadow. I don't know. I think he's just really cool. But uh, finally found the Marshadow tin. So I had to get it. It is a 2007 tin, so it's only two years old. It shouldn't have been as hard to find as it has been, but... We did get it, so we'll do that um, in a minute. But to get more sleeves, let's go ahead and rip these bad boys open. Plus, I want to do the uh, Dragon Majesties. You guys know, one of my favorite sets ever. I got to do it. They actually had more. They had, a, I think, at least one more I saw, maybe two more. Um, oh, man. <laughs> so you know you got ripped um i thought these were some of the like the pokemon ones like the actual pokemon ones i had like the red gyarados on it you know from 
What is that one? Whatever that set is. Breakpoint, I think. I thought that's what these were. So I thought it'll be worth it. You know, wow, that was loud. Um, so it's not really, not really gonna be worth it. Can't tell, these are not really that great. Um, it don't matter, they're sleeves, whatever. I'm just gonna throw stuff in them. Let's, let's just rip through these. Fates Clyde, just to get it out of the way. Cause we really don't care about Fates Collide. So fun fact, I did, code card, I did get a, uh, is that X and Y? Or is that Sun and Moon? That is X and Y, one, two, three. Um, I know for sure when I was stationed in Oklahoma, I one day just randomly bought a uh, Fates Collide booster box just because I, up to that point, I haven't opened Pokemon cards since Neo, the whole Neo set, you know, the second generation set of cards. I just bought them and I pulled whatever that Mega Alakazam rare card, whatever that like top card was at the time, I pulled it out of there. And the people at the little game shop that I bought from uh, were freaking out and wanting to buy it for like 40 bucks and whatnot. And I was just like, nah, I'm gonna hold on to it. Don't be like me. Don't be like me. Pupitar, energy reset. Whoa. Servine, Deerling, Riolu, Snubble. Um, we have Binecle, Binecle, Bronzor, Reverse. Mr. Mom, that is a rare card though, um, so that's kind of cool. And we have Mothum, so kind of exactly what you would expect out of a Fates Clyde. But now we're gonna get into the Dragon Majesties. One of my favorite sets. Last time we opened these, I got the uh, uh, Lance card. Yeah, the Lance card. Um, and that was prism card, and I was so stoked about that. I can't remember. Is this three to the front? One, two, three, four. Okay. No, I, I so I saw the energy, and that's why I stopped. I thought, did I pass the uh, the rare up? But I don't think I did. I just saw the energy, so I flipped. And we're gonna just go through Combuskin, that's an uncommon. Heatmore, that's an uncommon. And Crokinole. Okay, so I didn't mess this up. The rare should still be in the back. Um, is it this way? Yeah, that looks okay. And I'm sorry if the lighting is not that great in this room. I literally have every light on in this hotel room, and uh, it's still not that bright. That look at the Dratini art though. Look at that art. That is that is phenomenal. I love that. That is. Beautiful. All right, Trap Inch, Whooper, and we'll get up. God, I love Mr. Teenies. Oh, another great artwork. Okay, we have a reverse Litten. Uh, nothing too special there. And oh, oh, we got a golden secret rare trader card. All right, guys, I'm editing this video and I just realized that my um, screen recording for my cards that I usually do up here, actually, um, it stopped recording and I don't really know why. I did, at a little bit later point in this video, which you're about to see, I did get a notification that I was running out of memory, some storage space, so I cleared some of it up and that actually seemed to work, but... Uh, this is the gold trainer card that I pulled from that Dragon Majesty set. Just wanted to let you guys know that I did actually pull something. I'm not pulling your leg. Yes, I did get back-to-back um, -back videos with secret rare cards. Um, it's never happened before. It'll probably never happen again. I'm just enjoying the moment. So there we go. Back to the video. Okay, hopefully that fixes it. I pretty much ran out of storage on my phone and that's why it just shut off. So, um, kind of clear some space. Don't know why it did that, but it did. So, we are going to 
go through these, pop the coin out, <laughs> pop the coin out. Okay, there we go. So I think that's Xerneas, I think. Could be wrong. I don't know. I don't really know him that well. Um, don't want to damage or destroy anything. So there is the three pack code card. And we do have the, uh, you know, extremely bowed. I guess it doesn't look that bad on camera, but it is pretty bowed. Um, it doesn't look that great. But it's a hollow. So, you know, it is what it is. We'll put that back there. Let's go through these boosters. So, Forbidden Light. I'm not really sure at this moment what the, uh, the really good chase cards, if you will, are. Um, I've only opened these maybe uh, like two or three times is this x and y or is this sun and moon this is sun and moon so one two three four all right let me get rid of this we have a fire energy frog deer that's pretty cool sligo magneton now that's pretty some pretty cool artwork too litleo flabebe rockruff Fennekin, Inkay, we have Reverse Hollow Bergmite, so that's a pretty cool card, and we have, <laughs> look at that, Magna Bell, Max, baby, that's an Ultra Beast, wow, we've been getting some really solid pulls lately, I, I don't know what's going on, I don't know if my luck is about to like just drop off for like the next five years, but I hope that we just keep this up because this is really nice. That was really, really cool. Okay, so we pulled a Secret Rare and a GX already in three packs. Three packs. Unbelievable. All right, the next Forbidden Light. Let me go this way. Code card. For all of you wonderful people, one, two, three, and four. And we are going to start this one off with a fairy type energy. Fossil excavation map. That's kind of cool. Breaks in unit energy. That is really cool looking. I have no idea if that's really useful or not in the uh, TCG, but I don't. It, it looks cool. So, Panchum, Fennekin, Dupider, Gumi. We have a Reverse Krogunk, which, uh, really cool card. Is this focusing? I feel like this is not focused. Um, really cool card there, and okay, I will take that. Was that, Di Diantha? Diantha? It's a holographic trainer card, and uh, this is going to be going into the collection. Look at that shine. Wow, that is beautiful. Um, it is a rare card. You can play this card only if one of your fairy type Pokemon was knocked out. Uh, then you pull this last turn. Okay, well, shoot. It's a hollow. It's a rare. We're going to sleeve it up. We'll put her in the background. She's not quite as special as the rest of these, but, uh, you know, we'll let her think that. All right, we do have a Burning Shadows pack. We are still looking for that Rainbow Rare Charizard. Um, no idea at this point if we are going to get it or not. There is the code card. Um, it seems like it's a pretty hard one to pull. I mean, we've opened, we haven't opened a lot of Burning Shadows, but we opened enough that if we were going to get it, we probably would have gotten it by now. Right on. Hoot Hoot. Volpix. Lowen, that is. Ralts. Grimer. Lowen. Sneasel, we have Reverse Magikarp, my boy. There we go. That's a nice shine to it. And we have a Lycanroc non-holographic to finish it off, but that is okay. It's really not bad at all. So that um, was the, the Trio Blister Pack thing that I got. We're going to go right into the uh, Marshadow 10. Now this is the thing... Oh lord, this plastic man, they like they make these child proof and kid adult proof. <gasps> no! I'm sure you guys can already see the bow in the card here. <gasps> no! No, no, no. That's not what I want to see. 
Oh, this is heartbreaking. Because you guys know how... Oh my god. Look at how terrible that is. Look at how bad that is. Oh, what a waste. I love this card. Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to fix that. Oh, there's an upside down co card. That's just like, that's very disappointing right now. I'm very, very disappointed. Oh. I'll just have to get another one, I guess, right? That's what that means. All right, so we get two burning shadows in this one Guardians Rising and one Evolutions. We're going to do the Guardians Rising because that is the one that I probably want the least out of this, but this still has some pretty nice cards in it. So honestly, this tin is well worth it um, just because of the sets that are in it. And one, two, three, and four. I don't think I've ever pulled anything good out of Guardians Rising. Not that I can remember anyway. Energy Recycler, Whalmer, Trubbish, Jangmo O, Wimpod, Gumi. We have a uh, reverse cast form. I'm killing the game right now. Turtonator GX. Come at me, Kiawe. I got your Turtonator. Wow. What a pull. We are like, we are just really doing well lately. I don't know what the deal is. We are just doing really well. Hopefully, just our luck continues. Um, let's see. Let's do the Evolutions Pack. I was gonna. I was thinking about doing one burning shadows in between, but I'll just end up doing both um, at the same time. That's fine. So we're gonna go into the evolutions pack. Boom! Code card one, two, three. Right? Yeah. And see what we can get. Um, again, reverse hollow Charizard is the name of the game for this one. Um, Metapod. Imakuni's Do Duo. The second time we've pulled this, this is a secret rare card. We're gonna put this one off to the side because it, it's a secret rare. I mean, it's it's a good card. Haunter, Diglett, uh, Ghastly. There we go. We just need Gengar now. Caterpie, Drowsy, Magikarp. My boy again. Oh, we got another Reverse Hollow Gyarados. So I'm pretty sure like the very first. Um, Evolutions booster pack that I opened was had a reverse hollow Gyarados in it as well. That, my friends, is a solid pull. Starmie don't, don't really care about. But getting a reverse hollow like this, that's solid. I know they're not worth a ton. Um, but that's a really cool pull. You know what? For Imakuni, his uh, Do Duo. We're gonna put, we're gonna try out one of these new sleeves. Boom, there we go. So he's all sleeved up as well. We are not done. We still have two more packs. We have two more Burning Shadows. We're gonna leave my boy Marshadow for the end. I hope that you know he can give us some luck. If uh, whoever this is, I, I don't even know who the Necrozma maybe. I don't know what this is. I think it's an Ultra Beast, maybe? Whatever it is, we're saving it for the end. Or we're going to do this one first so we can save our shadow for the end. And go from there. One, two, three, four. And let's we'll see what we get. Charmeleon, Seedra. It's really cool. Oh, that is beautiful artwork. Lunatone. Look at that. Wow. Tynamo, Tangela, Ralts, Rhyhorn, Hoot Hoot. Reverse Alolan Vulpix. That's a really cool one. That's not bad. And Butterfree. That's really cool artwork. But why? Why is Butterfree's body so big? It looks pregnant. Am I the only one that's seeing that here? Or am I? Okay. Maybe. Maybe I'm the weird one. I don't know. 
That's okay. One more Burning Shadows pack. One last chance for Char uh, that uh, Rainbow Rare Charizard. Hopefully we can get some last pack magic. Oh, come on. All right. Code card. We've got one, two, three, and four. Here's hoping we can end with some magic here. Some fire, like Semi-Seer here. Dusclops, Metapod, Alolan Grimer, Letaba, Cutie Fly, Horsey, Venipod, Venipod, Venipede. We got a reverse Panpour, and to end it all off, oh, non-hollow Bruxish. Man, well, not every pack can be a winner. Clearly, our luck hit pretty hard in the beginning. Um, can't really complain about that because look at this. Our very first pull of the day was a secret rare golden trainer card, Switch Raft. Beautiful card. Then we got a GX, Naganadel GX Ultra Beast card. Phenomenal card. Then we got the Turtonator uh, GX card, which that's some sick artwork. I mean, that's really cool. Um, we pulled... Imakuni's Doe Duo, a secret rare card for the Illusion set. Awesome. We pulled a holographic Diantha. I always want to say Diana, but it's Diantha, I believe. A uh, hollow card, and it's got a really nice shine to it. And we pulled the reverse holographic rare Gyarados card from Evolutions. And ladies and gentlemen, that is all we have. Please, 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 if you did enjoy the video, drop a like. It, it goes a long way for me, and uh, it's a real quick, simple thing. Just hit that thumbs up button. That's all you got to do. Make me a happy man. I promise, it makes me a happy man <laughs> when I can see a lot of, a lot of likes. Um, comment down below. You know, Drop some comments. I, I try to, to get back to everybody as soon as I possibly can. Uh, I know sometimes I'm I'm not very fast at uh, really responding, but I promise I do try to get back as fast as I can. And uh, go ahead and subscribe if you're not already, because that's the only way you're going to see more of this content. And I do try to post a lot of this content. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I know I did. So we will see you guys in the next one.